Hello and welcome. My name is James Leach. I'm from Sony Professional Solutions. I'm here today with Robbie Fleming and we're going to be talking to you about the PXW Z280 and Z190 cameras. Um, first of all, we're going to do a quick explanation about why the new cameras have been introduced to the Sony lineup and the differences between the older cameras like the PXW X200. Yep. So let's jump straight in. Uh, Z280, maybe you can give a, a quick explanation about the, the differences on the Z280 compared to the X200. Yeah, I mean, if we look at the uh, the 200 cameras is probably the best way. So we had the uh, PMW and then we P the PXW cameras yep. as a 200. And they're really, really were a big seller for us. And they went into a lot of news and then a lot into higher places where, where it actually was a camera that just worked. Yes. And it ju just did the job. It's a camera you can pick up and it will work. You don't need to change the lens and it was very good. Um, what we looked at is we needed a 4K version of that. Yep. Uh, and because it's a, uh, a free chip camera, mm -hmm. uh, it gave excellent quality. So that's one of the reasons it was used. So what we needed to do was see what's the next model from that and what do we go to and how do we go to a 4K free chip camera. Yes. So what we actually come out with is a brand new camera taking all the best bits from the two 200s that we've had yes. into the 280 and actually making lots of different very small changes that will actually make it a really good camera for actually the, the market and the 4k market we okay have today. so you you mentioned key element of the two new cameras is the 4k three chip cmos sensor so um, maybe you can explain a little bit more detail about what the three chip actually does for the camera and why it's so yeah why it's so good to have that the differences are obviously you, on the free chip camera, um, you actually then uh, split the colors. Each color is going into one sensor, and actually and each pixel is based on one, that one color. So therefore, actually, you're getting better, uh, a better overview of picture as well and quality. When we do that in a, in a, a full frame sensor, we actually have to need to bear it between the three colors. Um, it's a slightly different process. The quality is both good, because mm -hmm. um, they have different uh, aspects of the cameras. Okay. Um, but obviously, with a, definitely a camera that would have fixed lens, a free chip camera actually looks to give it better picture quality. Right, yeah, so we're getting a much cleaner image, a clearer image, um, the less processing is, is happening within the, within the camera, right? A absolutely. Okay, good. Absolutely. Thank you very much for your time today, Robbie, much appreciated. If you'd like some more information on these two camcorders, please visit pro.sony. Thanks for watching, see you again soon.